strong emergence is the norm, not the exception. Physicists often insist that only weak emergence exists in nature. They argue that, in principle, the behavior of complex systems can always be reduced to the laws of their elementary constituents. Strong emergence, they say, is metaphysics, but both scientific practice and theory prove otherwise. Strong emergence is not an outlier. It is the rule. Scientific practice and theoretical reasoning both show that new, irreducible properties appear at higher levels of complexity. The reductionist in principle claim collapses under scrutiny. Let us begin with scientific practice. Take the hydrogen atom. Its spectral lines can be predicted with high accuracy by the Schrodinger equation using only Planck's constant. In this highly symmetric and compressible system, Planck's constant effectively encodes the full complexity regime. But now consider the diatomic molecule. Planck's constant alone is no longer enough. No amount of first principles calculation can predict molecular spectra without introducing new contextual parameters, bond lengths, vibrational and rotational modes. These are not conveniences, they are irreducible. Already at the level of two atoms, the reductionist in principle claim fails. If even simple molecules require new parameters to capture their behavior, imagine the irreducibility inherent in proteins, living cells, and beyond. The same lesson applies at cosmic scales. General relativity, based only on the gravitational constant g, succeeds in simple gravitational systems. Mercury's orbit, binary pulsars, and GPS satellites. But when applied to galaxies, it fails to explain flat rotation curves. Physicists salvage general relativity by postulating dark matter, an unobserved construct. Modified Newtonian dynamics instead introduces a new contextual parameter, a zero, and reproduces galactic dynamics without auxiliary inventions. Galaxies exhibit new, irreducible properties. The pattern is clear. Every step up in complexity demands new contextual parameters. This is not weakness in theory. It is a signal of irreducibility. Scientific practice itself disproves the reductionist view. Theoretical foundations confirm the same. Algorithmic information theory developed by Kolmogorov and Chaitin proves that complexity generates irreducibility. Without redundancy or symmetry, the shortest description of a system is as long as the system itself. Compression is rare. Symmetry is special. Irreducibility is the mathematical norm, not the exception. Compact laws apply only to highly symmetric, low-complexity systems. Everywhere else, new descriptions and parameters are unavoidable. Thus, the reductionist, in principle, claim collapses. Empirically, science itself introduces new parameters at each complexity threshold. Theoretically, mathematics guarantees irreducibility once redundancy is lost. Strong emergence is not metaphysical speculation. It is the structural reality of nature. Across molecules, galaxies, and information theory, irreducible properties appear as the norm. The true myth is reductionism itself. Strong emergence is not the exception. It is the rule. Complexity generates irreducibility. Recognizing this truth reshapes how we do science and how we understand the layered structure of reality.